So, if you've seen the adventures of Stickman Woman, then you would know that online, I really cannot draw. But today I thought of a drawing exercise, and I said that I had to prove to you that in the real world, the real world, I in fact can draw. So get out your art supplies and let's get moving. You're going to need a sharpener probably, erasers, pencils, or did that depend? You wouldn't need them if you're using erasable colored pencils like I am. Markers, crayons, whatever your preferred art supplies is. So right now you're just going to get out your pencil. For me, that's going to be my black erasable colored pencil. So you are going to think of a building, a type of building. For me, I'm going to go with a skyscraper. So you're going to sketch that on your page. And don't leave a bottom to it if you can. As long as it's not too important, don't leave a bottom to it. So just get the outline. Don't draw windows or doors or anything like that. Now add something to make it a little more whimsical. For me, I'm going to give my skyscraper wings and an eye on the top. There we go. And just for that eye. And you can start in drawing with your markers or anything, but I would highly suggest using something erasable. All right. So this is my building. Now we're still not going to work on it. Yes, I'm very mean. So now you are going to think of a thing something mystical. I am going to go with a portal, sort of portal thing, and feel free to make it overlap, but don't make it overlap if you're not using something erasable, because see right here, I need to erase. And don't worry about being Mr. Per Mr. Mr. Perfect. When you're erasing, it's only your rough draft. So, oh, there we go. Now I'm going to add a couple of little crystal thingies over here. Once again, with the overlapping, that's something you do a lot in art. You can also make items not appear all the way, like I did here with this crystal thingy, majiggy. I'm going to erase that right there, fill in the rest of it, and fix my portal. Now, for uh, considering I drew a portal, I'm going to draw the details, and right now you can draw your details too. Alright, so this is my portal, and this is my building. There we go. So now you're going to think of a landscape. And it can be as crazy as you want. It doesn't have to follow the rules of gravity or anything. All right, this is mine. So now you have to think of a plant. It can be real, it can be fake, it can be exotic, it can be a houseplant, whatever. Alright, now you're going to draw something in the sky. Once again, whatever you want. I, as you can see, I did like some sort of Venus flytrap type thing. Now, this looks like a sombrero, but I am attempting, desperately attempting, to make it into a UFO. 
Alright, I'll add the details on there later so it doesn't look as sombrero-ish. So now you can add something in the grass if you want. Well, it doesn't. It might not even be grass on your page, but just add some details to your picture, small details. So, once again, no doors or windows yet. Just add these little details. Like for me, my details are these little study thingies on the grass. Alright. So I've got these details over here. And then on my building, the only detail I'm going to do is just draw a little divider thingy right there. And I will add one quick thing to my UFO. Just make this band a little thicker. And add a little row of lights on the bottom. And don't worry if it's not perfect because this is your own, only your rough draft. And you can always go in and add some splashes of color to make it look a little better later. And hopefully follow my advice and did something erasable. Excuse me. <coughs> Ooh, sorry about that. So, yes, now you can add in your details. I know I was very mean to you. You can make your windows look weird. You don't even have to use windows. You could just do whatever you want. Make it all sorts of shapes. For me, I'm not even going to add a door. I'm so mean to everyone. Imagine living in this place looking out these windows. Better hope there's stairs, though. Alright, so I guess if you really want to get in, you climb through this window, right? Okay, so this is your rough draft of it. And in the next video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to decide on colors and make it look more realistic. I'll see you later. Bye!